Welcome to First Gen Diesel for Memorial Day weekend. We're going to put a new bumper on the D350. It was a little fender bender with my wife's truck a little while ago. Before that, she hit a deer. And before that, it was bent up before we even bought it. And I've straightened it out too many times, and now I'm just ready to, to replace the bumper. So we've got a new bumper, and um, that last accident got rid of a bolt and messed this bolt up so bad it just needs to be replaced. So uh, I've got a new set of bolts. And um, while I'm at it, I'm going to take this front piece off where the truck used to be silver below the trim line. And it's going to uh, get a new coat of paint where all the rock chips and everything is. Try to clean that up a little bit. All right. Let's do it. Now I'm going to get the brackets off. Okay, now we're gonna have to take the grill off to get to this piece right here. A few screws up here at the top and take these lights out and you can get to the screws behind it to hold everything up there. Now we need to take these brackets off so we can use it on the new bumper and uh, try to use some blaster or something on the threads. It makes life easier. And, uh, one of these makes life easier too. All right, now we get the new bumper and uh, put the brackets on there. Now, there's just a few bolts in this area, and this on this brace, and over here, and then I can take this piece off, and we can sand it down and get it ready to paint. As you can see here, I've got a tailgate project going on at the same time that I'll feature in a future video. We are using a two-part automotive paint system. I'm trying to get this paint done without sweating into the paint. It's pretty hard to do. When you sweat as bad as I do. But uh, we're going to get it done. So I think I'm just going to let this cure overnight and then uh, make sure it's nice and smooth. Right, I've got the new bumper sitting up here, sitting on some cushions so it don't get scratched up. I need to transfer the brackets from the old bumper. All right, I got that all cleaned up. I've got the bumper brackets 
ready to go. Now let's put this thing on the truck. Sorry guys, I did somehow lose the video footage of the fascia piece and the grill going back on. Looking straight on right here, it looks pretty damn straight. I may not need to adjust it at all, I just need to tighten down the bolts. Have a blessed Memorial Weekend, and thank you to all the soldiers out there for your service.